Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to explain and practically demonstrate a shortcut which can be used for importing predefined classes and interfaces in Eclipse IDE editor. So let's get started. So the shortcut that I am talking about is Control, Shift and M. Okay, if you have to import any predefined classes or interfaces in Eclipse IDE, okay, then we can select that predefined class or interface which need to be imported from a particular package and all. Select that and press these three keys together. That is Control, Shift and M. Let me show you this practically. Let's switch to this Eclipse IDE. Here we have a project which is already configured with Selenium library. And uh, here we have a class. Inside the class, we have the main method. Inside the main method, I'm going to write some Selenium automation code. You can write any code. It's not about Selenium automation. Any code. It can be Java code. It can be Selenium code. Let me write some Selenium code, okay? I'll, I'll create something like web driver driver is equal to new. Chrome driver like this, okay? Then you see, if I have to manually import this web driver, I have to hold the mouse and select this option, import web driver option from Selenium library, okay? From Selenium, we have to import this web driver interface. Similarly, if I have to manually import this Chrome driver, hold the mouse and select this import Chrome driver thing, okay? That is the general thing that people will do. So instead of doing that, instead of hovering the mouse and selecting that option, what you can else do is just select that predefined interface or class. Okay, just select the predefined interface or class, which is giving that uh, error. Okay, just select that and press Control Shift M. That's it. You see, if there is only one import statement, it will be automatically imported. You don't have to hover and press uh, select that option using your mouse. You select this control shift m you just say done this may save time sometimes okay or many times also okay there may be some situations where there may be multiple import statements okay the class predefined class or interface that you want to import may belong to multiple libraries okay i'm going to show an example of a predefined class uh, which uh, not only belongs to selenium library but also belongs to java library so let me write the statement what will happen let's see throw new okay no such element exception okay there is a no such element exception class in java and also in selenium okay so here i'll put a semicolon now you see i have to import this okay if you hover the mouse on this you are, you'll get two import statements you see import no such element exception from java import no such element exception from selenium two are there in this case also if you try the shortcut control shift m shortcut Okay, there's no problem with this. Okay, instead of importing automatically, what it will do is it will ask you to select the required library from which you have to import this predefined class. Okay, from Java you want to import or from Selenium you want to import, it will give you a dialog. You select this and press Ctrl Shift M keys together and you'll get this add import. And since it is confused, okay, it cannot automatically import, right? If there is only one import statement like web driver or Chrome driver, it would have automatically imported, okay? They would have automatically added this import statement, but in this case of no such element uh, exception, uh, something is from Java library, and also we have this no such element class from Selenium library. I'll go with the Selenium library and say, okay, guys. And here still error is coming because I have to add some text, okay? So that's it, okay? So this is a way of importing the shortcut I have used is Control Shift M, okay? You have to press Control Shift and M. This will sometimes save your time, guys. You don't have to hover and just select the import statement, just press Control Shift M. That's it, select it. Select the class that need to be imported or select the interface that need to be imported and without thinking much, press Control Shift M. If it is only one import statement, it will save your time, okay? So, hope guys, you understood this session. Thank you, bye.